In 1950, a report emerged of an elephant who fought against humans to protect its own kind from the Panamure area. There are still those in Panamure who remember this incident which occurred nearly 61 years ago. News First journeyed in search of the Panamure elephant kraal which rose to fame due to this incident. <laughs> The Panamure Elephant Kraal was a very important landmark in the area during the pre-independence era. The Kraal was located in the Nindagama area in Manduanvela on a plot of land belonging to a powerful local leader known as Manduanvela Rate Mahatya or Manduanvela Mahadisave. The elephant trade was in its glory days back then and Kraal owners reaped plenty of profits. The ownership of the Panamure Kraal eventually passed from Manduanvela Rate Mahatya to Sir Francis Mulamure, the first Speaker of Parliament. I was in charge of several storerooms where food was kept for elephants at the kraal. My father was the person who closed all the gates after the elephants came in. There were 17 elephants at the kraal in 1950 when an elephant went on a rampage against several domesticated elephants and workers at the kraal. We could not capture him. He was running everywhere. We tried using a metal wire to restrict him, but a toenail of the elephant broke off and he went out of control. Thereafter, Molamure told us to shoot him. Francis Molamure ordered that the pachyderm should be killed with one shot. It was Commodore Sami Kadragamar of the Sri Lankan Navy who eventually carried out this order. The incident took place on the 9th of August 1950. Soon after, Governor General Lord Solbury, who witnessed the death of this pachyderm, passed regulations against the capture of wild elephants. What is the current state of the Panamure elephant kraal? News First will take a look at this tomorrow. <laughs>